first at nine o'clock, Tulsa police say a record number of people are parking illegally near the fairgrounds this week. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Lori Fulbright. News on Six's Grant Stevens tagged along with the traffic officers tonight who say this illegal parking isn't just a hassle. It's a safety hazard. Grant. It sure is, Lori, and the streets out here in the neighborhoods just south of the fairgrounds are particularly narrow. You can imagine with cars parked on both sides, it'd be tough to get a car through, let alone a fire truck or an ambulance. And that's exactly what Tulsa police are concerned about. Parking near the fairgrounds is a big problem. I thought we'd find a spot and just go in, but it's not the case. If you've been to the fair, chances are you feel Elijah Allward's pain. Nearly every street in the neighborhood surrounding the fairgrounds is choked with cars. It took us about, I'd say, 15 minutes to find a spot. Tulsa Police Sergeant Will Dalsing says many people have tried to skip that way and park illegally. I can say that on a, on a weeknight like tonight, we're probably going to have 100 to 150 parking tickets written out here. It's double that number on the weekends. Dalsing says they're on track to have the busiest parking enforcement year in the 10 years he's been patrolling the area around the fair, which could be since the free shuttles didn't run this year. So here's the problem. We have to have enough space for emergency vehicles to get to, to houses. And so the parking is limited by signs to one side of the road or the other on some of the more narrow roads. Sergeant Dalsing says the area south of the fairgrounds is the worst. People blocking driveways, parking too far from the curb. But most common is this. People parking on corners past signs telling them they can't park there. If you call for an ambulance, you want to get to your house. If they can't get through, that's a problem. Tulsa Police is out here tonight. I've seen a couple cars drive by. Tickets are anywhere from 35 to 50 bucks, but if you're parked in front of a driveway or a hydrant, you'll be towed. Live in Tulsa, Grant Stevens, Oklahoma's own News on 6.